Hey guys, Nick Holden here, aka DVD Collector 96, and welcome to a new video on my YouTube channel. Okay guys, so you know uh, Disney is a big part of my collection, so my goal is to be bringing little by little uh, Disney titles to the channel. And today I want to share with you my copy of Aladdin on Silbook and let me go behind the scenes uh, first before before we go to the Silbook of the movie and everything. So uh, this was actually the first Disney title that I ever purchased for my collection. I remember I had to Best Buy, they were releasing uh, the Walt Disney Signature Collection copies. I was a little bit late to the game and then I went to the store and I decided to pick up this copy and the first Pixar movie that I got on the same day was Ratatouille. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that name incorrectly. So, I just saw this beautiful still book on the shelf and I'm like, I, I need to get it. Uh, Aladdin was a big part of me growing up. This was one of the movies that I watched a lot on repeat. Um, one of the things is since I live in Cuba, almost all these movies I watch them all the time in Spanish uh, and I know a lot of songs in Spanish so it was interesting for me coming to the US to actually revisit the film with the original cast voices and I have to say I love them so this little bad boy right here on Silver was uh, who uh, sorry, what's the movie that started my obsession collecting Disney movies that I actually grew up with and at the point I was still collecting Marvel and I'm trying to go little by little to add titles to my collection but so far uh, I'm happy with the Disney result that I have I'm a member of the Disney Movie Club, the amazing Disney Movie Club I still owe you guys a video about the Disney Movie Club but I've used the link that I'm going to be leaving below you can get 5 movies for the dollar and I will be discussing a little extra on the video about the Disney Movie Club. Now, Aladdin uh, was part of the Walt Disney Signature Collection. Uh, in this case, this is the 4K version of the movie. So you have the beautiful uh, title there with this beautiful picture. Then you have there the, the symbol and then on the back you get the genie. Now, about Aladdin, uh, this movie is one of the Disney movies that I will give a 10 out of 10. I love every single song, I love every single aspect about the movie and uh, my memories watching it as a kid, I do enjoy it a lot. Uh, the genie was the amazing Robin Williams and beautiful performance, like I said, beautiful songs and beautiful everything. So in this case you will get on the steelbook, you get the 4K uh, version of the movie plus the Blu-ray plus the detail code. Let's go ahead and open it up so you guys can see it. So once you open it. You get the digital code, of course, uh, on Movies Anywhere, like usual, and then this was the back spine. So since this is one of the seal books that I'm going to be showing on the channel that I've already opened uh, before, this is what I do with the back of the seal books. So for example, here you can see it was a, only a Best Buy, so it was a Best Buy exclusive. The original animated classic limited edition collectible seal book, Disney's Aladdin, 4K Ultra HD plus Blu-ray plus digital code. As you can see there and that's the promotion of the seal book and then this will be the back now uh, in this case uh, the addition of the movie you will get the 4k ultra HD and so in the 4k ultra HD you only get the movie with the new format and then you get the blu-ray of the movie which will be the movie plus bonus extras now for this movie we get two ways to watch we have the original theatrical version and the scene alone mode to be honest, um, since I've been revisiting, uh, sorry, re-watching Disney movies uh, in English, I have never seen a scene alone version. The first one, actually, that I'm going to be watching like a scene alone version is uh, Little Mermaid uh, New Life Action as soon as I get it. We have, in this case, an alternate ending. I'm excited to watch that. So this is one of the movies that I have on my pending list that I actually wanted to be re-watching it. I rather did watch it in English once, but I never watched the special features, uh, which is something that I love. I guess I didn't have the time and I just watched the movie on that day. Then we have Aladdin on Aladdin, a Scott Winner's personal journey as the voice of Aladdin. 
Uh, then we have Let's Not Be Too Hasty, Join the Cast in the Recording Booth. Plus classic bonus including the genie outtakes and filmmaking commentary and much more. Now, this is something that I've talked uh, on a previous video, guys. As soon as you get your copy of the movie, always check the digital code if you redeem it because there is a lot of previous versions from the Disney movies like Diamond Editions and things like that. And the special features sometimes vary by format and sometimes on previous editions they have extra special features. So as soon as you redeem the digital code, you will get all of them. It happened to me when I was watching The Little Mermaid. I realized that my digital copy of Movies Anywhere had a lot of more special features that I have on the actual physical copy of the movie. So always be on the check for that if you love watching special features of the movie. Now, one of the things at the time that I love about collecting steelbooks as well, not only because of steelbook, is that on the 4K you get uh, cover art on the disc. If you get a regular 4K, if I'm not mistaken from Disney, you just get the Blu-ray, it will be a blue disc, and then the 4K will be the black and the DVDs are usually white. But in the case of steelbooks, you always get cover art on the disc, I'm sorry. And then you get on the Blu-ray, you get the beautiful lamp from the genie and then on the background you get the beautiful castle from Aladdin that we all remember and we all do to love now um, this movie like I said at the beginning is a 10 out of 10 for me um, I was actually in the US when they started promoting the Disney Signature Collection this was one of the last titles they re released, if I'm not mistaken, after this they released The 101 Dalmatians and then they released Sleeping Beauty and that was the end of the signature edition because that was the beginning of Disney+. Plus. But this movie, 10 out of 10, uh, a Disney classic that if you love collecting physical media and you love collecting Disney, you'll be on everybody's collection. Please let me know in the comments if you have ever uh, watched it, of course, if I guess if you grew up um, like around before the 2000s and everything you grew up watching this thing as me and let me know if you ever watch it and let me know if you have uh, any other editions of this movie like the diamond edition and things like that I'm not so sure if this, this was released on the previous editions but I'm seeing so that they actually released it but uh, that will be all on today's video like I always say I hope you guys are enjoying this Disney you're gonna content in the channel if you are please let me know in the comments give me a like and please subscribe to my YouTube channel so we can keep this on the going and see you guys again soon on a new video.